This is Colin Stewart, Innovation Writer of the Orange County Register, taking you inside Edwards Life Sciences of Irvine, which has developed two techniques for replacing failing heart valves without major surgery. Edwards Sapien Transcatheter Heart Valve is really intended for patients who aren't well served by current therapies, by current open heart surgery for aortic valve replacement. One approach for replacing the patient's heart valve is we do what's called a transfemoral approach, where we come through the femoral artery in the leg and we thread a catheter up over the aortic arch and then we're able to place the valve inside of their native valve and then we use a balloon to expand that valve into place and replace their native valve. The catheter is introduced through the femoral artery and threaded up over the aortic arch. A balloon is inserted into the native valve and it's inflated to open the native valve. A new balloon catheter that's already pre-mounted with the transcatheter heart valve is placed and inflated. That catheter is then removed and the transcatheter valve is now replaced the native valve and functioning. The second type of catheter is for patients with narrow or diseased arteries. The transapical procedure starts with an incision between the ribs. There's an incision made in the apex of the heart and a wire is placed. Then a balloon is brought up and is used to open the native aortic valve. The balloon catheter is then removed. A larger catheter is now placed and the transcatheter heart valve mounted on a balloon is deployed in the native valve. The introducer is then removed and the incision in the apex of the heart is closed. and the transcatheter valve is now functioning in replacement of the native valve. Edwards hopes the system will be approved for sale in Europe later this year and go on the market in the United States three years after that. Thank you for joining me. This is Colin Stewart from the Orange County Register.